So let's see how we can check logs in Azure function. So first of all, let's uh, open the VS code. In this, like uh, we already created Azure function in the previous video to check that how to set up and uh, create Azure function. I click on the I button. So now we will just uh, write uh, context dot log and uh, we'll just write one of the comment. So we'll just write uh, log at line number five. Similarly, we'll just write log at uh, line number four. So I will change five to seven. So we'll just deploy this piece of code uh, into the Azure function which we have created. Click on the deploy, and uh, so now we can come to Azure Azure uh, portal login and try to log in into the Azure portal. I've already logged in into the Azure portal. We'll open the function which we have created. So let's go to the function. We'll just duplicate this tab so that we can uh, see the logs simultaneously, parallelly. So we'll just uh, click on the monitor tab here, monitor navigation uh, URL. So we'll just go to code and test in one of the tab and uh, in another tab like we will go to monitor and logs so if you have still haven't uh, subscribed or liked the channel please do that now we'll just click on run and uh, we'll see the log so we can see that a log at line number four and line number seven as is getting printed so by this way we can use the logs we can see the logs if there is any error and all you'll be able to see that over there in the log section so like it's better to give a context.log uh, before uh, giving the response to the from the server uh, we will just print the uh, response message so that uh, we are sure that like even if it uh, is giving a wrong message in the logs we can check so i'm i'm trying to deploy the code after uh, doing that so it hardly takes some 10 to 20 seconds to deploy the azure functions if you have missed the setup of the vs code so i will be mentioning the video link in the description please check that so let's go to the logs and now uh, if I try to test the new function which uh, we created so so we are able to see the this is the output from the Azure. Thanks for watching.